All right, hi everybody, John Meadows here, and we're back in the kitchen. We're making some really good food, specifically, well, my wife's making really good food, I'm just eating it. But specifically, we're making some crock pot chili with some lean beef. It's really good. Um, this is a great, just basic, uh, pretty low fat, high protein meal. You can use it really for any, you know, any meal plan. If you just need something uh, healthy and high protein, hey, we got you covered right here. The other thing is, is it's winter here in Ohio. It's getting really cold. And who doesn't love a nice big bowl of hot chili in the winter? It's absolutely one of my favorites. Your nice thing about this is the ease at which you can make it. You can make this thing so easy, even if you have a crock pot that's like 30, 40 years old, as you'll see. So lean beef chili made in a crock pot. Let's, uh, let's, let's show you how we get it done. All right, so um, we talk about the purpose of this meal, just a good lean meal. Now, what if you're trying to gain muscle? Like what if you're trying to get into a caloric surplus and gain some weight? Well, we have some options here that I wanna show you. One of them is adding avocado, all right? So avocado is an excellent fat, high in potassium, high in monounsaturated fat. That's the fat that's good for your heart. So very healthy. Um, these have these little containers right here have nine grams of fat they have about six grams of carbs and they have one gram of protein a little bit it's about 100 calories a little bit over 100 calories so you can use one of those i'm going to put some in here in a minute and that's going to give you an extra 100 calories particularly some healthy fat now what if you want to add even more calories well you can add some colby jack cheese which is my favorite this also has nine grams of fat, and you kind of flip-flop the macros for the protein and the carbs. So this has one gram of carb and six grams of protein. A little over 100 calories. Um, as long as you tolerate cheese, that's okay. But so now you got another 100 calories or so. And then if you want to add some sour cream, we can do that as well. Basically, it's just fat. Five, six grams of fat. It's cultured cream tastes really good so if you add basically a serving of those three things you're going to add about 250 calories to your meal um, mostly healthy fats mostly um, but anyway so that's a way that you can alter this meal if you're trying to gain muscle in a very simple way so I'm going to go ahead and throw some on here now this avocado by the way this holy avocado company is awesome they have some spicy avocado too which I really like so I'm going to add some avocado to this. There's a serving there. We're going to sprinkle some cheese on there. I like to go kind of light on the cheese. That wasn't a serving of cheese. So a little bit. That's all we need for me. I'm not trying to gain any weight. I just want it to taste a little bit better. It already tastes awesome, by the way. So, nice hot chili. You could even add some crackers if you want. I'm not going to tell you those are good for you, though. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this very simple recipe. And um, we got another recipe coming for, it's like a turkey chicken chili, we'll call it. So keep your eyes open for that one as well. We're going to put the macros up so you can see them, and that's it. Enjoy. If you make this meal, let us know what you think, or if you have any ways that you would spice it up and add something else in, let us, let us know as well. Thanks for watching.